Welcome to the demonstration of 32Soft's Multi-Sales Order Data Loader. This data loader was designed especially for QAD customer service users who manage a large number of sales orders every day using QAD's 7.1.1 menu. You'll find that this tool allows you to easily import sales order data into Excel spreadsheets from a variety of sources where you can review and edit sales order details. Then, quickly and safely upload your revised data into QAD without going through the multi-paged sales order maintenance menu. This is the tool you need to vastly improve order entry in QAD. Let's take a look at how Multi-Sales Order Data Loader can help you create sales orders massively with greater efficiency and accuracy. When we open the Data Loader, we see a familiar Excel spreadsheet with the addition of the Data Loader banner. The banner includes filtering options and action buttons, which allow us to download data from QAD or import data from external sources, as well as upload modified data back into QAD. To get started, we must first select the correct database. We click the Setup button to find the appropriate database and select it. As many databases as are needed can be set up by the administrator in the data loader. There are multiple ways to import sales order data. We can download existing sales orders from QAD using the filter fields in the banner, which are highlighted in yellow. These fields allow us to filter records by sales order number, customer number, order date, site, and item number ranges. We can also select to download open lines only. If we leave filter fields open, all sales order line records will be downloaded. We can also import sales orders from customers' structured files using the Open button. Clicking on the Open button allows us to browse and open a file from our customer. The loader will read the file and paste the data into the spreadsheet. To ensure data imports properly, we will work closely with any organization electing to add the import functionality. We can also enter sales orders manually, of course. Let's download existing sales orders from QAD. We'll enter specific search parameters such as a customer number range and order date as well. Once the filter parameters have been entered, we can select the download button. As soon as we select any of the action buttons for the first time, a login screen appears. As with all 32Soft data loaders, the multi-sales order data loader uses QAD authentication logic to validate user ID and password. This data loader validates that the user has access to menu 7.1.1. Let's log in. The data is downloaded and we now see all sales order records that match our search criteria. Gray highlighted headers indicate read-only fields, so the values from these columns will not be uploaded into QAD. Green highlighted headers indicate fully writable fields, so we can edit the value in these columns. Yellow headers indicate fields that can be edited, but if left blank, the loader will populate them with the corresponding data after the successful upload. In this demonstration, we will modify some of the attributes of the downloaded sales orders, and we will upload them into QAD as new sales orders. Since data loaders utilize standard Excel spreadsheets, we have all of Excel's functionality, so we can simply copy-paste data from one cell to other cells. First, let's delete the lines we do not need. There are three sales orders displayed. Let's add one more line to the second sales order. We can insert a row and copy the values from the line above. Then we can modify some of the attributes to create the new entry. If we do not know the exact number, we can enter a partial item number or description and use the lookup button. The matching item numbers will be displayed. We can click to make our selection. We can also generate two reports to get the inventory and MRP details about a line item. 
We just select the item and click on the Allocated Inventory button to display the Allocated Inventory report from QAD in a pop-up window. Similarly, we can click on the 23.16 MRP Detail button to display the MRP Detail report. Let's modify the dates. And let's delete the sales order numbers, and the data loader will automatically assign the next available number after a successful upload. Also, let's change the ship via for some of the lines. Once we have reviewed our data, we can select the Validate button. The loader will validate all the data we have entered. As we'll see in a moment, validation is a very useful step, but it is optional because the same validation process will run when we use the Upload button to upload the sales orders into QAD. A pop-up screen displays the status of the validation and will indicate if our data contains errors. As with all 32Soft data loaders, multi-sales order data loader validates data in the cells against genuine QAD logic and will return an error message if inaccurate data is submitted, as in this case. When we encounter an error, we close the status window and correct the error before attempting to validate or upload the data again. We can use the Find Error button to find and fix all errors in the file. Cells that contain errors are highlighted in red. When we place the cursor in the cell, the reason for the error is displayed. We must correct all errors before resubmitting our data. Let's try to find the next error and fix it. Let's see if there are any other errors. There are no more errors, so let's try to validate again. This time the validation is successful. We can close the status window. This optional validation step is not only useful for identifying errors. Upon successful validation, the data loader pulls informative and default data from QAD into the spreadsheet such as the default ship to and bill to addresses, the site if it has not been entered previously, the item description, type, default freight terms, and ship via if not previously entered by the user. After the successful validation, we can upload the orders into QAD. We simply click on the Upload button. Again, a pop-up window is displayed, and we see the status of the upload. The upload was successful, and we can see that the new sales order numbers are displayed in the first column. Of course, we can also enter sales order numbers manually prior to the upload. We can use the View SO button to verify that the sales order was properly uploaded into QAD. We select the sales order number we want to view and click on the View SO button. Standard QAD SO print will be displayed in a pop-up window. Please note that for this demonstration, we have shown our generic QAD multi-sales order data loader. For any special requirements, such as adding or modifying fields, we will be happy to analyze your processes and can customize the data loader to best fit your needs. As demonstrated, this easy-to-use productivity tool enables you to easily create a large number of sales orders safely and efficiently in QAD using convenient Excel spreadsheets. 32Soft's multi-sales order data loader will increase your productivity, reduce errors, and significantly contribute to your bottom line. For more information about this and other productivity tools, or to start your free 60-day trial, email us at contact at 32soft.com. And please be sure to visit our website to sign up for our free educational webinars, www.32soft.com. Thank you for your interest in our productivity tools and for watching this demonstration.